In today's video, we'll be looking at three new things that are added to Laravel version 9.43.0. So let's get started. The first thing that has been added is the support for eager loading specific columns to, with, where, has. This wasn't possible on the older version of Laravel. So here, let me show you here in the Tinkerwell in the older version of Laravel. If we did like this, user with post, if I show you over here, user model, inside this user model, then I have this posts relationship has many post relationship so here if i get the user with these post and also let's say has posts like this if the user has posts and with posts like this then i would only get the id user id and title of the posts and you can see here id user id and title but the combination of this with and has which is this with where has it wasn't possible so let me show you here in the earlier version of laravel if I run it, then it would say me this call to undefined method, this. But now in the latest version of Laravel, if I try to run this, then it will perfectly work fine. You can see here. And if I don't write these, then it will give me all the columns of the post. And it is contributed by TFRs. Now let us move to the second thing, which is add policies to the model so command. So on the previous version of Laravel, whenever we ran the artisan command model so, then it wouldn't show us the policies. But now it will actually show us. So this is the Laravel old, so Laratips old. So we'll say PHP artisan model so user here. Then it wouldn't show us the policies. But now here, if we again run PHP artisan model so directly, it will not show us the policies over here. But if we just go over here in let's say auth service provider and here if I just write here user class and user policy and again come here and run this one, okay. Then we will see here policy and this app user policy. But on the previous version of Laravel, we didn't see that. And this feature is contributed by Hinkle. Now let us move to the third and the final thing, which is when is you lead is added to this stringable. So here, let me show you that here in the Laratips latest version. So previously there was this when is UUID method. And as you have seen in my previous video, you lead is also added to the stringable class. So just to make it similar to that of the when is UUID, this when is you lead is also added. You can see here it is a UUID string and it is a you lead string over here. And if I run this when is you lead to this actually you lead string, then it will show this and if it is not, then it will show this. Okay. So if I run it on the right side, you will see this is you lead. And now if I just write here, let's say you lead over here and run it, then it will say it is not UUID. So this was previously available and now there is this when is you lead, which means that if it is true, this thing is true, then it will go over here. And if it is false, it will go over here. We don't have to write if else condition over here. It is similar to the if else condition, but with closures. So in this case, it should show this one. So if I run it, then is you lead. And if I just say UUID, then it should show this. If I run it, then you can see is not a ULID. 